<laughs> Red crayon. For or against is a challenge that has appeared in some of the Bardic Madness' past. Challenges change and rotate uh, over time. In this particular one, someone from the audience will give you a, a topic or a position and then ask you on the spur of the moment to argue for or against that particular position. Okay. Um, Beatrice, you've got an idea, obviously. I have a query. Do we get to choose which position he takes? Oh, yeah. Or does he choose? I have a topic. <laughs> <laughs> you have a comment? I have a choose, topic. but I have, the top, I have a topic, if that's all right. Uh -huh. Well, there you go. Choose for or against babies with hair. <laughs> <laughs> Do you get a choice in that matter when you're... Obviously, the answer has to be. There are many reasons why having children with hair is useful. First of all, the most obvious reason is that you say... Babies with hair. Babies with hair. Children have real hair. Well, yeah. But babies with hair. First of all, you save so much money on hats. Because they don't stay on if they have hair. And they don't really need them because they stay warm. Second of all, you are guaranteed to be able to predict the first comment that someone sees when they see your baby. Look at all that hair! <laughs> But the third and most obvious reason that I am for babies with hair is, of course, that my, my very own, nine weeks ago on Tuesday, was born with a full head of hair. And it relieved me to see all of that hair on my baby daughter because now I know where it all went. 